Hello and welcome to 365 Days of Excelling with Fly. This is day eight, and today we are looking at a formula called dollar. So what does it do? Imagine you have a report which you compile on a monthly basis, and at the end of that report, you just summarize the report in some sentences. For example, what I have here, I have sentences explaining what is in this report. So here I've set up a formula which will just pick up the totals here and put them in my summaries here. But the drawback which I have with this formula is that it's giving me a long number, which is very difficult to read. Like for example, this one, it is giving me long number, which is very difficult to read. All I need to see is the properly formatted number here. If you look at the second sentence here, the number looks fine, but the drawback is that if I change, for example, here, if I delete this, it's not going to automatically update because it's hard coded. So I want something that is going to respond to whatever I do here so that every month I don't have to worry about updating all these numbers. All I have to do is to just make sure I update the total and this automatically gets updated. So how do I do that? How do I convert this formula? Uh, into something that can be readable as this one at the bottom here. So here, all I need to do is to change here where I'm referencing to my cell here. So for example, I'm referencing to I12 here. So instead of just saying equal I12, I just put behind it dollar. And open brackets, I12. So you can see now that this text is still in my formula, but it's properly formatted as currency. So that's what I can do. So I can use the same for the rest of the numbers. Yeah, that's it. Thank you, guys.